assalam alaikum dear students how are you all i hope you all will be fine i am your teacher amrish this video lesson is for grade 9 from chapter number 7 linear equation and inequalities our today's topic is the solution of inequality it means how we can solve the given inequality the method of solving an algebraic inequality in one variable is explained with the help of following example solve 9 minus 7x is greater than 19 minus 2x where x belongs to real number okay how we will solve this one you know that your left hand side uh, should have all the variables involving in the inequality and your right hand side should have all the constant so removing the minus 2 variable from the right hand side you will add the 2x on each side of inequality as you will add this minus 2x and plus 2x will be cancel each other and when you are adding the 2x with the minus 7x it becomes minus 5x because due to the opposite sign they will be subtracted and the sign of a greater value will become with the answer so we will have 9 minus 5x is greater than 19 as you are observing that our minus 2x is removed from the right hand side okay now you are observing that this 9 is on the left side of inequality which we don't want over here so for this purpose i will subtract the 9 okay so minus 9 over here uh, to the right side and to the left side as minus 9 i will write minus plus will be cancel out and 19 minus 9 is equal to 10 so minus 5x is greater than 10 okay now uh, to remove that minus 5 uh, from uh, from the variable we will uh, multiply both side by minus 1 upon 5 so when i will multiply and you are observing that this is a negative number less than 0 when we are multiplying a negative number on both the side of inequality our inequality will be reversed so this Uh, minus 5 will be cancel out with the 1 upon minus 5 and only x will remain over here and 10 when i will multiply it minus 1 upon 5 so it become minus 2 so finally we have the solution for the given inequality that our x is less than minus 2 okay now we are moving to the exercise uh, 7.3 question number 1 the uh, solve the following inequalities and this is the part number 3 x minus 1 by 2 x is greater and equal to minus 7 plus 1 upon 4 x okay now we are starting the solution for this purpose uh, we are combining the uh, variables to the uh, left hand side as i told you so this is sub, uh, adding over there 1 upon 4 x it is adding on the right side when i will move it to the uh, left side it will be opposite means plus become minus so 1 upon 2x minus 1 upon 4x is greater or equal to minus 7 and with the minus 4 it is um, as you are observing that this 4 is adding over there when i will move it to the other side it will be subtracted so uh, we will take the lcm of 2 and 4 that will be equal to 4 and as my 2 is not equal to 4 to make it 4 i will multiply the numerator and denominator by 2 so 2 ones are 2 and over here it is already 4 which is our lcm i will multiply with the 1 so minus 2 and minus 1 become minus 3 upon 4 after taking the lcm and x it is a variable we will write with that greater and equal to minus 11 because uh, the minus 7 and minus 4 both are the negative number so they will be added okay now this minus sign i want to remove from both the sides for this purpose i will multiply the inequality with the negative sign so this minus minus becomes plus and this minus minus also become plus but as i told you earlier that when we are multiplying any negative uh, sign or number with the inequality it will be reverse so my greater and equal to will change into less and equal to sign and now you are observing that 3 upon 
uh, it is multiplying with the x take it to the other side so it will be opposite means the reciprocal will be there so 3 upon 4 when i will move to the other side it become 4 upon 3 so 4 11s are 44 upon 3 finally i have the value of x so x is less or equal to 44 upon 3 now we are moving to the second example or uh, the question uh, that is 4 x minus 2 into 5 minus 2x greater and equal to 6x minus 3 whole 1 upon 2. Uh, we will apply a distributive law over there. If anything is multiplying after the bracket, it will multiply with all the values. So x minus 5 2 are 10 and due to this negative sign, all the sign inside the bracket will be changed. So this plus uh, 5 become minus and this minus 2 become plus. Uh, minus minus plus 2 2s are 4x greater and equal to 6x and over there uh, this uh, mixed number I will change into the fraction 2 3 is 6 uh, plus 1 is equal to 7 upon 2 ok now we are taking all the constants to the right side and all the variables to the left side so x plus 4x these are the two variables I am adding them two to the same side that will become 5x minus 6x because this x is positive on the right side when I will move to the left side it will be negative greater and equal to 10 as this 10 is negative on the left hand side when I am moving to the right hand side it becomes negative and minus 7 by 2 again we are taking an uh, LCM if there is no denominator then there is a 1 so the LCM of 1 and 2 will be equal to 2 and as uh, we have to multiply 10 by 2 so 10 twos are 20 minus 7 20 minus 7 will be 13 upon 2 and over here you are observing that 5x minus 6x they have the opposite sign one is positive and other is negative so the answer will be minus x is greater and equal to 13 upon 2 and I want to remove that negative sign from the x for this purpose I will multiply the inequality with the minus so this minus become plus and my inequality will be reversed means greater and equal to will change into less and equal to and uh, this uh, 6.5 as I divided 13 by 2 so the answer is 6.5 if you don't want to write in the decimal you can write as a fraction no issue at all and it will be minus 6.5 or minus 13 by 2 so finally the value of x is uh, less or equal to minus 6.5 or 13 by 2 it is your choice either you want to write the fraction or decimal ok now we are moving to the uh, second uh, sorry seventh part that is 3 into x minus 1 minus x minus 2 is greater than minus 2 into x plus 4 uh, again I will apply the distributive law over there if any number is multiplying outside the bracket it will multiply with all the values so 3 ones are 3x minus 3 ones are 3 and due to this negative sign out of the bracket it will change all the sign inside so minus x and minus minus become plus plus 2 is greater than uh, minus 2 ones are 2 x and minus my uh, plus minus become minus and 4 twos are 8 now uh, uh, observe over there that 3 x and minus x opposite signs are there so they will be uh, subtracted and uh, it become minus uh, sorry it become 2x and this uh, constant minus 3 and plus 2 again uh, have opposite signs so they will be subtracted and we will have minus 1 is greater than minus 2x minus 8 now I am combining the variables to the left hand side and the constant to the right hand side so 2x and this minus 2x I am moving to the uh, left hand side it become plus 2x and this minus 1 moving to the right hand side it become plus so 2 2 uh, sorry 2 plus 2 is equal to 4x is greater than minus 7 and now you are observing that 4 is a constant multiplying with the 4 with the x I am taking it to the other side so it will be divided so x is greater than minus 7 upon 4 so finally we have the value of x is greater than minus 7 upon 4 4. Now we are moving to the 8th part 2 whole 2 by 3x plus 
2 by 3 into 5x minus 4 is greater than minus 1 by 3 into 8x plus 7. First of all, change the mixed uh, fraction into the simple fraction. 2 3s are 6. 6 plus 2 is equal to 8 upon 3x plus um, now this is a fraction we are multiplying inside the brackets as a distributive law. 5 to the 10 upon 3x and 4 to the 8 upon 3 is greater than minus 8 1 the 8 upon 3x and plus minus minus 7 1 the 7 upon 3. As you are observing all the denominators are 3. So the LCM will be 3 and I am multiplying uh, the inequality with the 3. So this all the denominator will be removed. So 8x plus 10x minus 8 is greater than minus 8x minus 7. Now 8 and 10x uh, uh, both are positive. So they will be added. Uh, 8 plus 10 is equal to 18x minus 8 is greater than minus 8 minus 7. Now uh, take all the uh, variables to the left hand side. So this minus 8 when moved to the left hand side becomes plus 8x. And this minus 8 constant, I am moving to the right hand side, it becomes plus 8. So 8 plus 8, 18 plus 8 is equal to 26x and minus 7 plus 8 becomes 1 because of the opposite sign they will be subtracted. And this 26 is a constant which is multiplying with the x. When I will move it to the other side, it will be divided. So x is greater than 1 upon 26. This is the final solution that x is greater than 1 upon 26 and I hope you will nicely understand the fraction and the simple linear equations then uh, sorry inequalities then how we can find the solution of these inequalities thank you